So question number 12, we have what is the name of BR2O? So for this, we have to first review what type of molecule this is. So with that being said, we have a bromine, well, two bromines and one oxygen. So that is both non-metals. So this is going to be a covalent compound because there's no metals present. This is a non-metal bonded with a non-metal. Okay. And because of that, it does have slightly different naming rules. Okay. To where we actually have to um, indicate how many of each we have. Okay. So with that being said, we have two bromines. So we have, if we write out, dibromine. Okay, that is what we're going to start with. All right. And now for the oxygen, even though um, it's only one of them, because this is now the second part, I guess the anion or just the second part of the name, we still have to specify typically how many oxygens we have. In this case, we only have one. So it would be dibromine mono, oops, mon oxygen. And now there's a reason why I wrote it like this, okay? Because this isn't completed yet. The thing I want you to always recognize is that even for covalent drop compounds, we are dropping the oxygen part and adding the IBE. Now this right here should be the name for that molecule. It should be dibromine monoxide. Okay. So with this, let's see what choices we have. We have bromine one oxide. Bromine is not a metal, so it, not even a transition metal, so it would definitely not have that. We have bromine oxide. Once again, not a metal in any of them, so they cannot go by the um, ionic naming rules. Dibromine monoxide. So considering that it's literally exactly what we got, we can kind of say it's C, but we're still going to cross out the other ones to C. Bromate. That is definitely not it. Um, because bromate would actually be an ion typically, and it would be something like BrO3 or something like that. Um, if I were to think about it, I don't know off the top of my head what it would be. Or maybe it would be BrO4. BrO4 minus, something like that. That'd be probably what we're looking at for a bromate. Um, but all I'm saying, that's definitely not it. We would not have a bromate there. And bromine 2 oxide, once again, this is implying that it's a transition metal, which it is not. So we're not going to pick that either. So C is really the only choice you can pick here because it is a covalent compound. So as we said, the name is dibromine monoxide. So this is correct. Now for question number 13. 